I could tell that you're all disciplined people. You've got one of those three things down already. Master the fundamentals. Instill discipline. And do everything you do with love. You're disciplined. You all went quiet when we walked up here on the, on the podium. Before we begin the next uh, the next session, we want to take a comment from one of the women in the class. We're always trying to draw women's voices out in these efforts. And we talked with one during the break and she tells me that she's got something profound to say. And she's the lady smiling with the biggest smile in the back right now. Her, her name is Lem Lem. Lem Lem so I'm going to give her the microphone and we're going to listen to the wisdom of this lady right now. Xavier and Demarabas at Ezer Kifalai, Bagilly Lissara, but him yes for the game Menden now, Ilan, Imajamari out Yakena, Bagrupachin to a Yenabet, Buzumitara Kasabi Lena, Masavachin and Deno, And Demari, Bavajamari Lissara, but him Mika Bonagar, Zim Kamatan, Yoser Nakalano Siltana, Yega Banyana, Bagrupum Layaura and Batman Deno, Madamet, Yemen Maraun Hus, Madamet. Uletanya Tamanyanet, Sustanya Kenanet, Aratanya and Nasashinet, Wim Demo, Manek Akat, Tilk Summit, Amistanya Degmo, Baras Matamaman, Fikarena, Tegist, Yemen Maraun Sout, and Mauk, Nanyin Nagaruch, Barasach Lake had a regan Bohala, Lemon Marahus Bukasaletan. Yemen Marahus Bedagmo, Zi Sinamar and Desamotana, Larasik, Aralinia Melo to look on a girl, Afachin Camina Garo Yilik, Tagbarachin Migal Tono So, Tolulik Abale Michelona, Hinen Bezbulek Ada Regan Bohala, Timotheus in Wedamafelek, Matalan, Malat Nozari in the Tamarno, Zagas and Matagan, Yavuletan Yon, Kufilt Yak and a Ballo, Sumenda Zila, Bazi. Kefil gizi ust, ekziaberi tanagaran, and kulfu nagar yiglazu. Bazi kefil gile gizi ust, kulfu ya mila un nagar, but amat beke joalo lemon. Bafit kamen nauk awilik, ahun bamisat ansalt anale, kulfu no ba ust ek arraling and nagar alla. Talantna rajum gizi ust ansal na wai na bara. Mari ay waladum, mari salat anal na yu thawalo na, but am na bara samai na bara. Mary in death no Yemisalet and on it I will let him build Yak Ekavitan a stone over Lazat Yak M. Dagmo, Exaber so Malsis at Omen Donialut Xiav here Yabarinatans a guy is at all, Baza Babarinas a guy me will let do allu gin so but a set of Marinas a ga Bahagaru Bahal, Bamino but a cavavi, Xiaber on his own saga, Moglet Wemdemo, Basarale Mawal Yechila Yemilo, Tilikulf Boste, Caralin Yemilo, Cabudunachum Garitanaga Garna Bethnagar, Yeno. Huletanya Dagmo, Timotiusin, Yemenagano, Castamar no husband, no, Yastamar no husband, Dagmo, and Datanagar Kut, Kanagar no Castamar no Yilik, but he was touching in my own Tagbar no Mayona, Macharasha lays in Nagaruna Barutman deno, Abraham, Masawat, Lexiavir, Masawat, and Scamacharasha time, Xavier and Abuk Otnebara, Yisak and Quan, Masoatu, Yamasoatu Bagetale, Yamasoatu Chatal Labulus Eco, Xavier, Yamasoatu. Bagazagajalbulo, Messawatan. Naka and Dagalgai, Mary Yemit Abeco, Bajamaria, Rasun, Messawat, Scamich Arasha, the Ras Malatano, Catasawabala, Tasawia Munim, Yemisawa, Timotiusen, Mafrat and Demichel in Interrechalo, I'm second. Good 
That was excellent as well. I, I like, Lem Lem, I like what you said about your life speaks more profoundly than your words. And the other point that you were making at the end that was very significant is that you have to give all that you have. Those comments are both very, very true, and they really hit at the heart of effective leadership. The question that I could ask each of you, and we should ask ourselves every day, how am I really living? How am I really living? The quality of your life lived for Christ will determine everything about you. Okay. We're going to go on now. I have one of the great privileges that I have, uh, have had multiple times, and that is introducing my wife She is an excellent, excellent teacher. She is a profound student of the Bible. In the original languages, by the way, Greek and Hebrew. And she has the gift of being able to articulate what she wants to say in a way that everyone can understand it. She told me to keep the introduction short. And <laughs> but it is very difficult to introduce somebody like this in two or three sentences. But I know she has a lot to say, and I'm going to turn this over to her now for all of our benefit. Please welcome Stacy Nicole. Greetings. I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. It is a real privilege to stand before you today because I am the direct beneficiary of everything we're discussing. God has sent people to pour into my life. Without which I would not be here before you today. I am a teacher and a student. I am ever learning. I am ever growing. I am committed to be all that he has called me to be. For his glory and for his namesake. Everything he had in mind when he knit me together in my mother's womb. That's who I want to be. Friends, to whom much is given, much is required. 
being an example to the flock. As Pastor Sinishat said this morning out of 1 Peter 5, cannot happen without the right heart. This session is about humble faithfulness in leadership. And I would submit to you that that requires a heart change. So as we journey today on the path of intentional development as we raise leaders, I'm going to ask you to first look at you. Friends, we cannot take people to a place we have not been. I'm going to repeat that for you. We cannot take people to a place that we have not been. We cannot give people what we do not yet possess. So we must be one thing first, which is self-aware. The second thing we must be is situationally aware. So as a teacher, I'm objective-driven today. I'm going to ask you to take notes. But not just what I say. I've asked the Spirit of the Lord to speak to you. I hope you forget me. But I pray that the Lord would move by the power of His Spirit on your heart today. For that to happen, friends. You must avail yourself. You must hear what the Spirit of the Lord is speaking to you. You must commit to that. And then commit to put that to practice in your life. We all know this. Do we all do this? Do we all walk in this? It's kind of funny to me. When someone goes to church and says that the message reminded them of me. When I go to church, when I go into the Word, the Spirit is speaking to me about me. Not about you. Me first. Amen. Amen. To be an example, you must take that to heart every day. Day. The sermon that they see is more impactful than the sermon that they hear. So we must have a sober estimation of who we are. Amen. Amen. A sober estimation. Let me tell you a story. 
There was an old Indian warrior. And uh, Indian, we uh, know, Banna Sungadi, Adamt, Indian, America, Adamt, Indian, which me Balut Malatan. And he was teaching his grandson about life. He, he, Indian, and Gosano, America, Adamt, and Warriors Malatno, he is so ye, Leliju, Lelijuju, Yastamar, and a Bersilehuet. And he told the little boy, Lazalatan Shilich, and the Zialo. There's this fight going on inside of me. It's like a terrible fight between two wolves. One wolf is evil. It's anger and greed. Envy and superiority. Lies and ego. The other wolf is good. Malcolm. Joy and peace. Kindness and patience. And he looked to the grandson and said, Son, that same fight is going on in you. So the grandson thought just for a moment. And he said, which wolf will win, grandfather? And the grandfather answered, the one you feed. If you sow to the flesh, you will reap destruction. We know this. If you sow to the spirit, amen, that road leads to life. We must model before people the spirit of humility. Everything about servant leadership is marked by humility. Humility is unnatural to us. We must be honest with ourselves. All of us are born in sin and shaped in iniquity. But by the grace of God, he's given us another way. A way of life. So when we walk and we sow to the Spirit, we have to be intentional about what that means for each one of us. We have to chart the course and write things down as God deals with those dark places in our hearts. Why do you think this is so important? That we're able to articulate the journey. That we're able to share about the challenges along the narrow way. Because there's someone right behind you that needs to be encouraged by your life. That needs to know that even though there may be two wolves, by the power of the Holy Spirit of God, they can rise above and choose the path of life. Amen. 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 We cannot 
give away what we do not have. Saints, we never arrive. Sorry? We never arrive. This battle is ongoing. And as you identify the Timothys in your life, they will ask you, how did you rise above? Are you willing to be transparent? Are you willing to roll up your sleeves and listen? Are you willing to, as the Lord addresses those heart issues of your own, are you willing to deliberately and intentionally pour into someone else by also being transparent and sharing your life and your story? That's humility. You come low. That's humility. The definition of humility by Verdon Grounds. Verdon Grounds by Mibal Sow. Yet it's after yes. It is the spontaneous recognition. We can read the whole thing. It is the spontaneous recognition of the creature's absolute dependence on his creator. Humility is total dependence on God to work in us what is pleasing to Him. So as we Pursue life in the spirit. As we avail our hearts. As we sow the good things. As we seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. With the expectation that all these things will be added unto us as well. We can expect him to cultivate in us the fruit of the Spirit. You all know this. But how many of us live this? When you identify your Timothy, he or she may smell like a sheep. You may not see any joy or any peace. You may not see any love or any patience. You may not see any kindness. But if God has called you to minister to that person, you have to give them what you first possess. You have to be patient. You have to be kind. I think about this a lot. Someone saw in me 
what I did not see in myself. Someone saw in me great potential. God gave someone eyes to see me. When I was living in absolute rebellion. And when they saw me, they spoke life to me. And they showed me the way. When I did not have joy, not only did they show me how to get joy, the word, the spirit, good relationships, amen, in the amen. body of Christ, sound godly relationships. But they believed in me. It takes absolute humility to stoop that low and pour in that deeply. I love it. The kingdom of God where he says in Mark 9 and 35 the last shall be first. I love the kingdom economy. The things that the world looks at and exalts is of no consequence to God. We have the greatest example in our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Let's turn to Philippians 2. And I'm going to ask Hermes to read for us verses 3 to 8. As we look at this first principle about how you have to first go down in order to go up. Philippians 2, verses 3 to 8. Okay. Lower Ganey, take a mile by mile, when you and in Quanata. Nagargin, a yan dandu balinger on Karaswilik and the Shalbet and Nykter. A yan dandu larasu and Mitakmon in Melket. La Balinger of Dagmo and G. La Balinger of Dagmunj. Bacristos, Iesus, Yenaber, Ihasap, Benantes and the Dagmo Yun. Ursu, Bagziaber Melk Sinor Salle, Kaxiavir Gar Metakalin, Makamat in the Mika Banager, Alcotaro. Nagargin, Yabariam Melkizo. Besau misali hono rasun bado adaraga. Be Muslim inda sau tagento rasun awar lada. Lamotim yahum yamask al mot inkwan yathazaza hona ilal. Amen. Our example. Misali achin. Write that down. Yehinins afut. When people start telling you how good you are, so which nante minahal turundo hona chusi nagwachu. When people start clamoring after you and exalting you. Go here and get a true picture of godliness. Of servant leadership. Of self-sacrifice and selflessness. You talk about leadership. That I'll follow all day long. If I know that you would die for me, you would stoop down to make me great. You, you care that much for me. Saints, God not only loves you, <laughs> but he knows you. A lot of people say they love you, but they really don't know you. 
Oh, to be known and loved. While we were yet sinners, Christ died for the ungodly. Teach them. Teach those who are looking up to you that they are valued, that they are loved, that they are important, so important that they are deserving of your undivided attention. Those who are following you, they know how busy you are. When you carve an hour out of every week to spend with them, just to listen to them just to pray with them just to encourage them just to allow them to come and pick some of your fruit Amen it tells them I am valuable. I'm worth their time. I'm worth their energy. Amen. Amen. I brought up here with me today one of my one of my prayer journals. Yes, and in the very front cover, I keep the names of my six Timothys. And when I'm making my weekly schedule at work, and I'm a full-time student, and a full-time international director, I have a husband, <laughs> I have a family, so like you, we're busy. He was, but I'm busy now. I tell them each one. You are important to me. Let me tell you how important you are to me. In my schedule for the week, I put the big rocks in first. I put them on my calendar someplace. And it is a rare occasion when I move them. And no matter what's going on in my world, I let them know that they are valuable to me by my actions and my words. And I don't say this to boast, but just to provide as an example, because someone did that for me. Someone did that for me. There's nothing quite like being known and loved. Let me show you the other side of this. Humility. Pride. Pride, they would say, is the root sin, the root of every sin. When Satan... <laughs> When he went before God in Ezekiel 28, his heart was elevated. And we know out of Isaiah, he wanted to be like the Most High. And although none of us would say we wanted to be like God, how many times do we walk self-righteously? How much do we secretly like the applause and praise of those who follow us? 
ብዙ ጊዜ እንዴት ምን ምን ያህል ጊዜ ይሆን የተከታዮቻችንን ምስጋናና ጭብጨባ የጠበቀን የምንቀሳቀስበት ጊዜ ብዛቱ ምን ያህል ይሆን how do we secretly hold on to things that make us self preserving የራሳችንን ጥቅም የሚያስከብርልን ነገር እንዴት አድርገን ተጠንቅቀን እንዚ ይሆን ምን ያህል ለራሳችን ጥቅም ሲባል ምን ያህል ዋጋ እየከፈልን ይሆን as opposed to self sacrificing ራሳችን ዋጋ ከፍለን መሄድ በመሄድ ፋንታ ዋጋ የሚያስከፍልን ነገር ትተን ባለንበት ቦታ ያለንን ነገር ለመጠበቅ ብለን ምን ያህል ዋጋ እየከፈልን ይሆን yesterday dr iyasu Dr. Iyasu tenantna yanesa hasab nebere mention that we should be like a bridge inde dildiyi mohon indallebin yesinnager nebere I love that analogy ihe nager ale tsodallo except people walk over bridges buzu sewoch ihe tugun inde dildiyi nihun inilallen gin bedildi lay bedildiyi layko sewoch ihe dallu yegamedu bachwal malatno I loved it when the lord said you will be a bridge egziaber ante dildi tihon alle bilo sinnager dess ilal adellem until people started to walk over me when you're humble truly humble you extend yourself and allow the people to walk over you the grace that you have received you freely give you are intentionally others focus ሙሉ ትኩረታችሁን በደም በሌላ በሌሎች ሰዎች ላይ ታደርጋላችሁ as opposed to inwardly focus ራስን ከመመልከት ይልቅ ሌሎችን በመመልከት ላይ ታተኩራላችሁ every decision is made based upon የምትወስኑት ውሳኔዎች በሙሉ የተመሰረቱት how this will be a blessing to you እንዴት ነው ለዚህ ይሄ ነገር ለዚህ ወንድም በረከት የሚሆነው እንዴት ነው ለሱ እንዴት ነው ይሄ ነገር በረከት የሚሆነው ለሱ እንዴት ነው ለሱ እንዴት ነው የሚሆነው ብለን ነው ምናስበው መልክ እንደዛ ትውት መሪዎች ከሆነን if you do not have that grace from above ከላይ ይሄ ጸጋ ካልተሰጣችሁ በስተቀር we are fully incapable of giving that type of selflessness away በማንነታችን በራሳችን በእብቴኛው መንገድ ያን ያህል ራሳችን ለመስጠት ብቃቱ ያለን ሰዎች አይደለንም ከእግዚአብሔር ካልተሰጠ in the kingdom first principle you must go down to come up መንግስተ ሰማያትን ባስቀደመ መንግስቱን ባስቀደመ መርህ ንንቀሳቀስ ያስፈልጋል principle 2 ሁለተኛው መሰረት you must be a developer ሁሌም አሳዳጊዎች ልትሆን ያስፈልጋል this is where the ቢዮች ልትሆን ያስፈልጋል this is where the idea of situational awareness ይሄ ሁኔታን ማወቅ የሚለው ነገር ከዛ ጋር የሚካተት ነው it comes into play ይሄ ይሄ እዚህ ጋር ማየት እንችላለን ይሄንን so you're not just <laughs> randomly doing things and acting out or living out your life ሁን በሁኔታ መመራት ማለት ዝም ብሎ የመጣውን ነገር ሁሉ በማስተናገድ መሄድ መሄድ አይደለም it is intentional ግን በትኩረትና ሆን ብለን ምናደርገው ነገር ነው turn with me if you will to your outline በእናንተ ባላችሁ በኖታችሁ ላይ እስቲ ይውና and to cover ራሱን ክፍል ሁለትን ካገኛችሁት ማለት ነው and there are a few heart conditions that we will discuss መማር ያለብን ማንበብ ያለብን የተወሰኑ ነጥቦች አሉ that are practical ተግባራዊ የሆኑ አራት ነጥቦች አሉ now as i said the sheep may smell like a sheep እንደም እንዳልኳችሁ በጓ በጎቹ በግበግ ነው የሚሸጡት ምንም ሌላ ነገር ሊሆኑ አይችሉም but there are a few things that that sheep must have in order to be discipled ይሄ በግ ግን በግ እንዲሆን በደቀመዝሙር እንዲሆን እንዲለወጥ ለማድረግ መከተል የሚገባን ነገሮች አሉ this is practical ተግባራዊ ነገር ነው The sheep must be led. We know this, right? Yeah, led. Ah, mbegochu memerat allebachu. So we look number 1 for a tender and compassionate heart. Andenya unetu ruguhu lib fellegu ilal. Andenya unetu. So as you pray and you ask the Lord for wisdom, legeta ohi tebebin mastwal sitayn bilachu bemitsalyubet gize about the person who you will sow into lemitzerubet sow lezin sow timotheosin sitayn bilachu sitsalyu you're looking for someone that is malleable 
ሊመራ የሚችል ሰው ነው መፈለግ ያለባችሁ willing to be cultivated ለማቅጣጫል እንዲሰጠው መንገድ እንዲሰጠው የሚፈልግ የሚፈልግ ሰው መሆን አለበት someone who is teachable ተማሪ ለመማር የሚችል ሰው someone who can learn to be forgiving ይቅር ለማለት መማር ይቅርታን መማር የሚችል ሰው Look here in Ephesians 4 Ephesians mraf 4 tlay sin melaket verse 32 Ephesians 4 32 tlay The Bible says and be kind to one another Ers bagsachu cheroch na rugochunu ilal Tender hearted rugochunu forgiving one another yiqirta tababalu even as God in Christ forgave you Ers bagsachu cheroch na rugochunu egziaberim demo be Christos yiqir indalacho yiqir tababalu ilal So we want them to be tender and they may not look tender but to be tender tuut mohon yasfelgachual sisis lib yasfelgachual and teachable tamari mohon allebacho but guess what you have to be nanta degmo min mohon allebacho forgiving yiqirbay mohon allebacho kind to mind legas mohon allebacho and always aware hullem demo litawqut miyasfelgaw nege mindinno of the ongoing work in your own heart bananta lib ust yallewn egziaber bananta ust yesar yallewn neger hullem litawq yasfelgal since none of us arrive hullachinim mannachinim yebekan we mannachinim yederesen aydellen from glory to glory to glory ka kibir wede kibir wede kibir no inji min hedo we are being conformed into the image of his son usun wede memsel yemollan no min hedo there's a look there's a look and in index bet min index bet philippians 2 there's a look yitale we're going there we desire yitano min hedo we have not yet arrived ganal deresnim they're behind us kohalachin leloch mikettelun alu we want to bring them along annasunim mizen nyam wedeza wede mislu wede teqeretsellin misil no min derso teachable tamari memmar yimichil two letenyaw netib a willingness fakadenya You cannot make an obstinate sheep move. Menum baka gitter yalen beg geftachun bilachu taskedut achilu. You cannot make an obstinate obstinate sheep move. Yihen baka menum alitazazim aligaram yalen beg geftachun litintiltulut atchilu. Yallemede yaltegeran beg menum litaregut atchilu. But be careful. Tatanka kugen. Judge nothing before its time. Yale gizew bemanum la tufredu. They may be hurt. And that nigzi waga skefalan. They may be afraid. Nalbat fartu yihunalu neza begoch yiqomut beqomubet bota. They have may have never been forgiven. Nalbat yiqir yalacho sewoch kezi bet kezi fi sila yiqir ta miyaqut neger aynoracho yihunal. That sheep may have never known love. Ihe beg nalbat fikir aq yihunal. It is our job to show them nyagin yisarachin masayetno. Offer them dil mastetno. A hand. Ej mastet. a word of encouragement yeb ye mabrata chaqalochin mistet some deliberate steps forward and and degmo qeden beqid indihedu madrek as we sow into them bennesu lay yezeran ballen ballen bet gize and then wait and watch kaza kezeran bohala metebek mi serotun sira mayet i was rebellious ani amatsanya sow neberku there was a time i was very rebellious betam amatsanya yeneberku bet gize neber especially in my young adult years my teenage years begurumis nay zaman malatno if you judge me then yanne ferdo binyi bihon noro besewoch beferd bene lay ferdo bihon noro you would never believe today zare attagnyunyum neber judge nothing before its time giz yale gizyo besewoch lay attfredu in john 8 and 29 be yohannes 8 29 lay servant leaders agelgay meriyoch will recognize difficulty or a problem aschegarin huneta weyim demo aschegari negerin i was a problem ani chegger neber ku nde kadekademi nde negerpachu and they will march forward regardless of the cost nezi asche benezi aschegari huneta gen qedmawuny neza sewoch yihedu li neber when god shows you your sheep እግዚአብሔር ይሄ ያንተ በግ ነው ብሎ እግዚአብሔር ካሳያችሁ Your Timothy ጢሞቴዎስአችሁን እግዚአብሔር ካሳያችሁ Do not be dismayed by what you see በመታዩት ነገር አትወሰኑ ይሄ በፍጹም ሊሆን አይችልም ብላችሁ አስቀድማችሁ አትወሰኑ Jesus says in John 8 verse 29 እየሱስ በዮሐንስ 8:29 ላይ እንደዚህ ይላል Go ahead and read that 
የላከኝም ከኔ ጋር ከኔ ጋር ነው እኔ ደስ የሚያሰኘውን ዘውትር አደርጋለሁ አብ ብቻይን አይተወኝም አላቸው I always do what pleases the father አብ የሚያስደስተውን አደር የላከኝን ደስ እኔ ማደርገው የላከኝን የሚያስደስተውን ነገር ነው ማለት ነው two fold here lesson ሁለት ምርት ከዚህ ቃል አለ if that is your heart ልባችሁ ይሄ ከሆነ if that is your desire ፍላጎታችሁ ይሄ ከሆነ god will equip you እግዚአብሔር እናንተን ያበቃችኋል ያስተጣቃችኋል for his purpose ለዓላማው ያስተጣቃችኋል and as you walk on that narrow way ይሄንን ጠባብ መንገድ በሚትሄዱበት ጊዜ ሁሉ that winding yet narrow way ጠባብና ውስብስብ በሆነ መንገድ ስትሄዱ with all of the difficulties በነዛ አስቸጋሪ ሁኔታዎች ሁሉ በሚትሄዱበት ጊዜ will inspire the one who is watching you እናንተ ከናንተ ኋላ የሚከተሏችሁን እናንተን የሚያወጡን ሰዎች መነቃቃት ይሰጣቸዋል እግዚአብሔር the people who have poured into my life lived this life this humble life እነን እዚህ እንድدرس በእኔ ህይወት ላይ ተጽኖ የፈጠሩ ሰዎች ይሄንን የትህትና ህይወት ኖረው ነው ያሳዩኝ and they held fast to what they believed they were called to do to the glory of god እግዚአብሔር ክብር የተጠሩበትን ዓላማ ጨብጠው ይዘው የተራመዱ ሰዎች ናቸው as they marched fervently በደንብ ተጠንቅቀው የተራመዱ ባለበት ጊዜ through the chaos ባስቸጋሪ ሁኔታ ውስጥ በሄዱበት ጊዜ saw me and then you brought me along and then him degmo yizawun yihedu a trust development that bene lay tlo basegeru huneta ust honom gin enenim amno yizawun yihedawal a holy respect qiddus yihona akbrot it's not easy qalla la idellem you know it's not easy qalla la idellem bende lelochin yizo magwas but is it worth it gin is it worth it what yitakma la idellem wagaw melkam no adellem ሌሎችን ይዞ መሄድ ሌሎችን ከፍ ማድረግ ይጣቀማል the other side of the coin ሌላው ደሞ የሳንቲሙ ሌላ ገጽታ for you for you ለናንተም ይጣቀማችሁ us ለኛ ለማን them ለተማሪዎቹና ለመሪዎቹ be weary of a hardened heart this he ሁሌ የሚጨነቅ ልብ ስለሱ ተጠንቀቁ guard your heart it is the well spring of life ህይወታቹ የመልካም ነገር ምንጭ ይሁን ልባቹ የመልካም ነገር ምንጭ እንዲሆን ጠብቁት too often in ministry አንዳንድ ጊዜ በአገልግሎት ውስጥ ወይም ብዙ ጊዜ በአገልግሎት ውስጥ we just start going through the motions በስሜት እንሄዳለን we preach and teach and have gatherings በመሄደበት ነገር እንስብሰባ እናደርጋለን ስብከት እናደርጋለን በቃ በመጥ እንደ እንዳመጣጡ ነገሮችን ያስተናገድን እንሄዳለን but because we been hurt ግን ቀድሞ በህይወታችን ላይ የነበረ ጣባሳ ስለነበረ disappointed የሆነ ሽንፈት ውድቀት ስለነበረ we stop sowing የሆነ ቦታ ላይ መዝራት እናቆማለን we stop intentionally going deep አላማ ሆን ብለን ሌል ወደ ሌሎች ጥልቀን መሄድ አንፈልግም we stop allowing ourselves to be a bridge ድልድይ መሆንን አንፈልግም እናቆማለን በእኔ ላይ ማንንም እንዲያልፈልግም እንላለን we get tired of being walked over በእኛ ላይ ሰዎች ሲሄዱ በማየት እንደክማለን this is where that time alone with god that refreshing time alone with god እዚጋ የሚጠቅመው ነገር ምንድነው ለብቻ ከእግዚአብሔር ጋር ጊዜ ማሳለፍ የመታደሻ ጊዜ ለራስ መስጠት እዚጋ ይጠቅማል it's essential ወሳይ ነገር ነው መሰረታዊ ነገር ነው nothing that i'm saying to you ought be new and i'm menegrachu way miskawun yenegedkwachu negeroch addis neger hono aidellem my prayer is that it becomes paramount yene tselot ahun menegrachu neger wanna ndihon ye tararaw chaf ndihon no the only thing that will unify our church betekristianachinen and le yadergilin nibretachin le yatanakirilin michil neger the body of christ at large ye kristosin akal inde taklallaw le yasadegaw le takmo michilaw neger his heart change yelibelawtinu and we can't do it nyalinna arago anchilim the two wolves uletu qaberoch our propensity is to go toward the pride the selfishness the self centeredness bizu gize minnagadilaw wedezi wede ras wedadu wede wede kifatu weyim degmo beggo neger wedemma wedemma yasibo wedezaw no min minnagadilaw there is none good but god kegziaber beqer mannin beggo yellem 
But as we avail ourselves, as we sow into other people with intentionality, with purpose, we avail our hearts to them. We're transparent and show them our own struggles. Our own challenges. And we commit ourselves and our time to them. Others too taste and see that the Lord is good. Amen. 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 On your sheet now, you see there's an application to this module. Number one is a personal, devotional question. I'm going to give you a list in a few moments of some of the heart issues that we normally, as people, deal with. My encouragement to you today is that you would allow the Lord to work in you what's pleasing to Him. Know this for sure. The enemy comes to pervert anything that's good. And Reverend Evan said this yesterday. Your gifts are, your talents, they're morally neutral. Not your spiritual gifts, but your talents, your abilities. Morally neutral. You can use them for good. You can use them for evil. Ask the Lord to help you to be intentional in using your gift to his glory and to extend that gift to those around you. Our group activity today is going to center on some common heart issues that we see in our life and in our ministry. Gregory, Gregory the Great made a list. Uh, of the seven deadly sins. That originate in the heart. You've heard these before. Pride. Lust. Wrath. Greed. Gluttony. Envy. Envy. And laziness. In our ministries, we see these sins, these heart issues played out around us. This morning, we're going to pass out, if you will. I'm going to ask you to turn into your groups now. And we'll give each group an issue to discuss. And we'll have the leader read one of the scriptures on the paper. 
መሪ የሆነው ሰው ወይም ደግሞ ሪፖርት የሚያቀርብልን ሰው በተሰጣቹ ወረቀት ላይ ያለችውን የመጽሐፍ ቅዱስ ጥቅስ ያነብልናል and discuss how that is that issue impacts your ministry ያንን ጥቅስ ካነበበላችሁ በኋላ በዛ ጥቅስ ላይ ያ ያ ነገር ይሄ ችግር እንዴት የናንተን አገልግሎት የናንተን በተክስቲያን ሊሆን ይችላል አገልግሎት ሊሆን ይችላል ድርጅት ሊሆን ይችላል እንዴት ተጽኖ እንደሚፈጥርበት ትወያለ ትወያያላችሁ ማለት ነው and the last part of the exercise የመጨረሻ ውይይት የውይይቱ አካል የሚሆነው because we are leaders እኛ መሪዎች ስለሆነን and we're solutions oriented ሁሉ ግዜ ደግሞ መፍቴ ፈላጊዎች ስለሆነን how do we solve that problem in our ministry ችግሩ አለ ችግሩ ይሄ ይሄ ነው ይሄ ይሄ ነው ታዲያ እንዴት እንፍታው ብለን እንወያያለን how do we address that problem in our ministry በእኛ ሚኒስትሪ ውስጥ በእኛ አገልግሎት ውስጥ እንዴት ነው ይሄን ነገር ምንፈታው ብለን እንጠይቃለን and how do we serve as a bridge to other people in our ministry በእኛ አገልግሎት ውስጥ እንዴት ነው ድልድይ መሆን ምንችለው የሚለው ነገር እንወያያለን enjoy your discussion we you touch you got 15 minutes ash 15 daqiqa mawayallachu malat no
ታርካችሁ ወደ የቦታችን መለስ እሺ ሁለት ደቂቃ የሚፈልጉ አሉ የጨረሳችሁ ጨረሳችሁ የስ አ አሳባችሁን እንግዲህ ምንድነው እናረጋው የተወሰናችሁትን አሁን እንቀበልና ከመሳ በኋላ ቀሪውን እንቀበላለን ስለዚህ ሁለት ደቂቃ ይቀራል ኦኬ እሺ ኦልሞስት ደን አይ ቲንክ ብዙዎች ጨርሰዋል እሺ መጨረሻ ላይ ያላችሁ ሶስት ቡድኖች ምሳሳት ላይ መከተል ትችላለህ ያላችሁ ይመስለኛል አለም ይቻላል ወይታችሁን ምሳሳት ላይ መከተል ትችላለህ ያላችሁ አሁን ሐሳባችሁን እንስማና ሰዓታችን እንድንጠቀም እሺ ኦኬ ኦኬ እሺ your attention please hasabachun wede zi yarku what we're going to do is uh, take a couple of group comments now we're going to break for lunch at 1 o'clock we come back and before i start the afternoon session we'll take a couple more comments mindinum minadergu ahun 10 guday le 7 now le misam kemotatachin befit አስር ደቂቃ አለን በዚህ አስር ደቂቃ ውስጥ የተወሰናችሁትን ሐሳብ እንቀበልና ከብሳ ለምሳወተን ከምሳስ እንመለስ ደግሞ ሁለተኛው ስልጣና ከመጀመራችን በፊት የጀመርነው ሌላ ተጨማሪ ሐሳቦች ወስደን እንደዛ እናጠቃለላለን ማለት ነው There's nothing more revealing than a group of godly people talking about sin በጣም እንደ በየእግዚአብሔር ሰዎች ተሰብስበው ስለ ኃጢያት እንደማውራታቸው ነገር በጣም የሚያስገርም ወይ ደግሞ በጣም የሚገርም ነገር የለም How many of you think we could extend this conversation through the rest of the afternoon? ይሄ ወይት ይርዘም ቢባል መቼም በጣም ይረዝማል አይደለም አሁን ቀጥሉ ብትባሉ ተዋይታችሁ ተዋይታችሁ አጫርሱትም Okay, I'm going to take a couple of volunteers. I'll bring the microphone to your spokesperson. And then we'll uh, we'll break for lunch. A volunteer to be number 1 right back there. First hand up. I'll come to you in just a second. Anya yeto yaye no sele sinfna no. ስንፍና የሚያመጣውን ውጤቶችን ዘርዘረናል ፍሪያማ እንዳንሆን በስንፍና ምን ይያዝና በስንፍና ምናገለግል ምን መራ ምን አስተምር ከሆነ ፍሪያማ እንዳንሆን ያደርገናል ለተከታዮቻችን ለጥሞቴዎች ስንፍናን እናስተምራለን እናስተላልፋለን ድህነት አንቆ ይዘናል ሪያያችንን ያጠፋል ከተልኮ ያስተጓጉለናል መፍቴ ብለን ያስቀምጥ ነው ተክቶ መስራት በመንፈስ መጠንከር ማስተማር መምከር መመገብ ትጋትን ለምንመረው ለጥሞቶቻችን በደም ባርገን ማስተላለፍ የወደቁትን ማንሳት መርዳት እና ነግሮችን ሁሉ በትጋት madrek yemilon yinen tawayaytenal the world is pulling everyone's attention away from 
ዓለም በተለያየ አቅጣጫ የሰዎችን ሐሳብ ለመሳብ የሞከረ ነው what god deems to be important እግዚአብሔር ዋና መሆን ሲገባው ዓለም በተለያየ መንገድ የሰዎችን ሐሳብ እየሳበች ነው ያለች so as you develop your timothys እናንተ ጢሞቶሶቻችሁን ለማድገ ለማሳደግ በመጥሩበት ጊዜ show them how to sow right here እዚህ ጋር እንዴት መዝራት እንደሚችሉ አሳዩአቸው this is the priority ይሄ ነው ቀድሚያ የሚሰጠው ብሏቸው prayer ጸሎት fasting Um, the word evangelism show them what that looks like in your life asaya kenante hiwot memar indichilu adirgwacho invite them with you kewden kenante ga gabzuacho most of our problem in the states ba america yenya chigir mindinno is that they're on the internet kullum neger ba internet lay no entertainment bemeznanyo alam lay no everything but god kullum neger alle egziabel gin yell So they would say they're hard working. Yona takto yesaru ndallu yemeslachwa. They're not sowing in the right place. Takto yesaru yemeslachwa algin betkikkelnya bota yesaru aydellu. They're sowing to the flesh. Yesaru yalut lesiganu. They're working 14 hours a day to make more money. Askarat saat beqen yesaru yebelete genzeb lemagnetno yetegu yalut. So that sloth or laziness yesinfinna sinfinna minnelo neger is one piece. And neger no but showing them what self discipline and pri- right prioritization sinfna lemasoged gin besrat na qedmiya mestet bemigebaw neger bemawq mehed what does that look like mindin no milaw neger lenasawqat how do i spend my time indet no gizen masalef yemet how do i make the right investment indet no tikkelnya neger madergo milaw lemaw this is what the next generation needs to see in us ay tulid benya lay mayet yallebet indet gizen endemnasalef lemen qedmiya endemn set no mawq that bless me as a teacher selezin dastamari turu barkonyal yesetachu tasayet that's the question i get all the time from my mentees buzu ke ne katach ne kem lene kem mastamrachu sewoch emagenyo astayet no show me what's important asfelagi yono neger mindin no cuz i don't know qidmi yamesetu yetu no no buzu gize bilo mitayikut and if we don't tell them qidmi yamesetet migebaw negetu ndon kal neger nacho the world will be happy to show them alam yasayachual min qidmi andemisetu thank you እኛን የደረሰን ቁጣ የሚል ነው ለቡድናችን የደረሰው ቁጣ ጥፋትን ያመጣል ቁጣ በደልን ያመጣል ቁጣ ሌላውን ያሳዝናል ቁጣ ሌሎችን እንደውም ወደ ሌላ ኃጢያት እንቢገፋቸዋል ለሲዮል ያበቃቸዋል ስለዚህ ከቁጣ ለመውጣት ማድረግ ያለብን ብለን ያነሳ ነው ትግስተኛ መሆን አስተዋይ መሆን ራስን መቆጣጠር self evaluation emilon rasen bemenfes qiddus hul gize bemenfes qiddus rasen mesetet na mekotater yin lemadreg degmo bezalot hul gize metgat yasfelgal min ilal mezaf qiddus sinnager qutta yesaw qutta yegziaberen zirq aysaram na selemil yenen madreg allebin selezi men madreg allebin ke qutta yilq melkam soch ruru soch tuhut mohon yasfelgal emilo hasab na yanesa no yenen imeslal Tomorrow we will talk about patience. Sila tigist nege demo na oralen. But I do want to remind you. And last I was at you me felgo neger alle. Remind myself. Sila rasenim last I was felgalle. That hurt people hurt people. Sewochin megudat lela lela sewochin mindin gode yadergal. Angry people. Ye mikotu sewoch are normally hurt people. Rasacho yetegodu sewoch nacho. Lashing out. Tfat yametal. I didn't list the angry man yes le qutu saw yalleñ and zigzir alle as someone to avoid betelehe ye qutta tequochin saw betechale meten lemaraq no metar yallebin be as wise as a serpent betechale meten inde ebab bilq mohon alleben tequochin saw betechale meten lemamlet no mokere and it's innocent as a dove inde ergib ye wa inde inde ergib ye wa inde ebab bilq mohon alleben because they may hurt you nezi sewoch yigodwachual but that does not mean we avoid them nezi sewoch gin malet futsum basoged malet aydellem as people of god degziaberso believers ndaman leaders ndemeri you don't get to be angry and sin in your anger behatiatna bekfuat bezaust linnemalales aygeba no matter how angry they make you lezi sewoch yet yemnunum yahal biyabasachuachu this is how i learned to pray 
I needed the Lord to set a guard at the gate of my lips. Two guards. I needed the Holy Spirit's help to tame my tongue. My gift in teaching the enemy gave me also he would pervert that gift and I had a sharp tongue but by the grace of God I learned that God could help me he could make me deliberate in my speech so now when people are angry he uses me as a bridge to, to show them how to submit themselves to the work of the Holy Spirit Amen, Amen. Anger is detrimental One of my favorite passages in scripture in Proverbs 31 it says she has the law of kindness on her lips. In Hebrew, that is Torah Hesed. Torah Hesed Preachers, you know, Hesed is that un, that inexplainable unimaginable love of God. It was the Hesed of God that sent his only son, the King of Glory. <laughs> Down to earth to rescue us. It's that same kind of Hesed that we teach. That is what I write on my paper. When I pray to the Lord, he, encouraged me, he encourages me to be deliberate in my speech. I pray about that almost every day. That I would use the gift that he's given me for his glory that I would guard my heart so those other things aren't in there profoundly and that the enemy doesn't use that gift to hurt someone but that the Lord would use that gift to raise up the next generation of leaders. Anger is detrimental to everything around it. Thank you for your comment. Yeah, yes, yes. We're going we're gonna to pray a closure over this morning's session. I'm going to bless the food we're about to, come, to eat, and we'll be back at 2 o'clock. Right. Please join me. Lord, we thank you this morning. You have surely made your presence known in this place. And sometimes we have little that we can say other than hallelujah. The highest praise. I pray that you would resonate in each of those that are here. The calling that you've placed on their lives. They would come to know that it is specific for them. That they are special in the eyes of you, Lord. And that you've called them to work. You've called them to labor. And you have called them to feed your sheep. Now I pray that you would take us to the place of eating now. 
that we thank you for the bounty that you are about to provide for us. We pray that you would bless it to our bodies and strengthen us by it. And we give great thanksgiving today for the food we are about ready to partake of. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Two o'clock. Thank you.